Once you've completed your registration, you can change the details of your registration at any time. Uh, just head over to the Eventbrite page, eventbrite.com, and log in with the email address that you um, signed up with. You may need to sign up initially. So I'm going to log in at learning2. Okay. And it should give you access. There we go. I can see my name up here to my tickets. And if you click on my tickets, you should be able to get to your learning to Asia or learning to Africa um, order and just come over to manage orders. Right. Once you've managed your order, if you needed to cancel for any reason, you could do that. Hopefully that's not going to happen. But I can come to the edit feature here and I can change some information. The main thing you're going to want to change is maybe your pre-conference choice. Uh, I might change, I want to switch to coaching and maybe your extended session, maybe instead of John Burns, I want to switch to David Lee. Okay, and you're ready to go. Um, and then I can just click save. One thing you need to be aware of, the person who placed the order is the only person who paid with the credit card is the only person who can do the editing. So if somebody in your school office used a school credit card to make to place the order, that person would need to log in with the account in order to make the changes. So you could go and help that person make the changes. If you used your own credit card, then you could make these changes at any time. Of course, it is subject to all of the limits on the, the different sessions. So if you were in uh, one extended session, and you switch to another and decided you want to go back to the original one, if it's full, then you won't be able to switch back to that. So please uh, be careful when making those changes. Um, know that it is subject to maximum session sizes, and uh, have fun.